Hello, everybody, and welcome to A Certain Point of View. Yes, don't adjust your set. I am not Jake. I'm Brian, and I am here with my lovely co-host, Jill and Molly, which Hello. I think her name's supposed to be up. I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm People know who we are. It's fine. Yeah, but, uh, yes, I'm here to uh, host today because Jake's power just went out. Oh, oh I know. Chaos. Ooh, welcome Chaos to Cal- has ensued. I mean, yes. well, yay for you hosting. Boo to Jake's power company. <laughs> I want to make that clear. <laughs> I, perhaps, Boo, I Brian's you hosting. Say, Boo, Boo, Jake. And I was like, okay, yeah. yeah Boo, Brian's, Brian's hosting. Uh, <laughs> yes. So, um, yeah, we're here to do a reaction to Jessica and Frankie. Little uh, singles match today. But uh, before we get going, how are we doing? I'm just happy to be here on a Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a true. Lot, a lot of people in the chat are like, "Oh my and gosh!" Like, what hashtag? What day is it? No, my um, yeah. my mom's my mom's birthday is next week, and so her and my stepdad wanted to go on a little date night. So they're like, "You don't need to come over for dinner," and I'm like, "Okay, <laughs> so here I am." Sounds good. So, Molly, um, how are? You? Oh, sorry. Here. Finish. Oh, now no, you're I'm drinking. Just, I'm, I'm hanging out. I got my angry orchard. We, I'm probably gonna go to have- bed. Le- we both have leftover cider from last weekend, I'm sure. I know. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's right. There was cider in the... God. God help us if you two were to get ever sponsored for happy hour. <gasps> oh, my Lord. I mean... I mean... Don't, threaten me with, don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> Do not threaten me with a good time, sir. I, no. I don't even know what we would do. All the drinks would have to be themed to that, and oh, oh no, oh oh no! Captain Morgan is sponsoring our happy hour, and we have to make a, a Captain Morgan happy hour drink. Oh darn! No, I no. mean, Cap- Captain Morgan, sponsor me, please. That Let's might. Th- there's a good chance we could we could do something with Captain Morgan next next month. Just saying. Wait, I have. We'll we'll discuss. Well, my people will call your people. <laughs> Uh, the Schmodown might be working with Captain Morgan. I don't know. Oh, oh, well, that's some, a little side. Some people might be getting sent booze. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. well, apparently, in that I didn't case, make that short list. <laughs> well, uh, Miss Molly, how are you doing today? I'm, I'm doing well. I uh, got my nails did today. The Ooh. tips are off. I went with a different highlighter color this time. Just bright orange. Um, yeah, it's the middle of the week. Never really know what to do in the middle of the week other than work. Uh, yeah. I know I'm bummed. I missed the Lego stream. And of course, it's the one where you actually finish. It Lego, is. So. You finished Great. it. You did we it. We finished R2-D2. Finished R2. We put, we put them next to our BB-8 Lego set. And like, oh. they, I think size-wise, they, they match up pretty well. But... Yeah, the R2 is cool. He's got little his little tool arms that come out, and he's got a, a little compartment in his head for Luke's lightsaber. Does he really? Aww. Yeah, oh, that's pretty cool. Nah. Is it separate? Do you have to like separately build Luke's like like lightsaber? Oh yeah, you. It's. I mean, the lightsaber itself was kind of lackluster, but it's like uh, really. Small. Come on, Lego. Step up your game. <laughs> Step up your game. Alex, you built. Making fun of me because I was like, eh, it's kind of meh. And he was like, it's tiny and it goes in his head. <laughs> <laughs> have you built your bonsai tree? Listen, no. Brian. <laughs> I, I have a lot on my plate right now. I just bought a new vacuum. Shout out to Prime Day. Um, but no, I'm not going to. I'm probably, that's probably going to be like my first. Your like, vacuum is the thing that you wanted to talk about. You were hyping and hollering over your processor. Oh, I got a food processor. Yeah. <laughs> the I vacuum. Did. So you well, can make pesto. Have... You literally, so that's, can... that's it. I can make like, I can make like fresh guacamole now. Like Sean's like, what are you going to make? And I'm like, you shut up and you're going to see what I'm going to make. Sir. <laughs> uh, he can use that to make you fresh uh, pasta, not pasta. It does come sauce. with a dough. It comes with a dough attachment, so it rolls the dough for you. So if mm. if someone wants to finally make me pizza after four years of dating, you know, 
throwing that out there. Just saying. Ooh. <laughs> I know. I was, th- I was like, a little shade, a little shade, but I appreciate it. But, uh, oh, well, no, wait. that's 100% shade. 100% okay, shade. Fair. All Lots the shade. shade. Lots of uh, shade. Molly, before we get going, what, uh, what Lego are you guys building next? Have you decided? I swear to God, if you we, see the bonsai tree. <laughs> <laughs> we have not decided yet. It'll be one of the Star Wars ones, but it'll be between. Um, we still have the cantina, which we've had that one for months. That's going to be and another big build. That would take you the rest of the year, probably. Uh, we also have the probe droid and Vader's mask. So we might Ooh. build the small ones before we get to another big one. I don't know. We'll see. Fun. Fun. Mm-hmm. Well, anyways, we are here. This is why Jake leads, because I would just keep doing this for the whole time. Uh, <laughs> we are here to do a reaction to Jessica and Frankie, a little bit of uh, a Den versus Usual Suspects match. Um, before we get going, we are going to make our predictions. Uh, I'll go first. I have Jess on my fantasy team. <laughs> that so makes I it easy. Jess. Yep. <laughs> I I, easy, I love easy. it. Any anytime I have someone on my team that isn't Flickinger because he was dropped. Um, uh, <laughs> have I'm you not? Have pick- you not traded him? You put pick oh, up the no. I drop already, him and pick up one of the FC people that go. I hot potatoed him out of there and got uh, three people. Okay. So okay, uh, cool. yeah, I'm picking cool. Jess because she's on my team, and um, I'm 99.9% positive Frankie is going to show up in a Yankees hat. So there's also that reason. Just saying. Molly, okay. who are you picking? Um, uh, I don't have any horses in this race, I don't think. But uh, I'm going to go with Jessica, just because I got to support my ladies in Schmodown. Fair. I don't even know who I'm playing. I should have checked. Go ahead. Uh, Jill? I don't want to. <laughs> oh, my God. Because they're both... Okay, so... They're both really great rookies, and I think they're both kind. I think both of them are kind of like under the radar right now, but they're both really good. Oh, uh, Frank has Frankie, of course. Of course he does. Mm-hmm. Let's just Got focus it. on. Let's just focus our anger on the fact that Frank is Frankie. Yeah, of course. Those that. Franks. Those Franks stick together. But um, Jill will continue uh, to plead the fifth. I'm pleading yeah. the fifth. <laughs> you, but you're never gonna last if you go on Watch It Happens Live and play Plead the Fifth. Just saying. Sorry. I don't know what that, that is. Broad. That's broad. sure. Sorry. I know. Uh, okay. Sure. Let me go ahead and pull this up. And God, I hope. See, I See, look, the out. chat's making it into a drinking game. I'm just helping the chat with their drinkage intake. <laughs> take a take you, a shot anytime Jill says Plead the Fifth. Drink you for too. the I don't want to from Jill. I don't wanna. <laughs> Uh, you two do enough to make people drink. Here we go. <laughs> I hope that was a compliment, we're Brian. Kind of, we're different type Absolutely. Did I share the sound? Season. They know the <laughs> yeah. stakes now. Okay, good. Because yeah. both Beth and Jess didn't get shook. Thank you, Leo. Opponent for choice on both their end. No oh, thanks, Leo. They both hit their five when it was necessary. They played like pros. They are in the big the Tetris league suit. And prove why. I love the Tetris suit. suit. Awesome. That and the <laughs> orange one for me. You can't not call him Colonel Carrot when he's wearing the orange. Oh, absolutely not. He better be wearing that when Thomas plays. Yeah. Like people can say, you know, oh, she's so. That's right. I love her nickname. In these study sessions, she's the very opposite of that. I trust me. (laughs) Sloth. (laughs) Look at all the sloths. I need that shirt. There's so many sloths. Is this thing on? Just wanted to All make the sure. sloths. I did not know she had a sloth collection. Oh. I mean, it, I guess it makes back at you. a lot That's of sense with their last game now. I don't even spoke about him. They forgot about, you know, the winner. I think anyone that's in my way is going to have to, you know, I think I think today they're going to have to put up or shut up. I'm not going to sit He played, I was going to say he played Lomas, didn't he? Oh, yeah. W. And I am back. <laughs> I love it. I love the sloth that's on the ground. Time to study. Uh, like I said to him, <laughs> matches are won and lost in round three. So there's no whiteboards. You you either know it or you don't. I am robot. That is correct. That is correct. 
two points. I oh, oh, hadn't chronic. noticed it until the playback. Um, until I watched the match myself. Of course, like, they got to add that to the promo. Yeah, yeah. I was <laughs> mortified. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but if Edited you by Nerd Chronic. Edited by Nerd Chronic. A little bit, you Make it a shirt. Make it a shirt. I'm, yeah, I'm waiting. The oh, Jessica's in slurred. the chat. Hi, the is, Hi I Jess. Know Beth May. I know her knowledge. I know her work ethic. She, she, she clawed her way to a very, very impressive victory against a very tough opponent. But she's going to have to do that? Plus a little more in order to get past the animal. Because I'll tell you right now, I smell blood in the water. <laughs> I love it. And Radis, I know you're watching. Shut your mouth. Oh. I'm going to deal with Jess first. Hey, that's my good. Oh, that's going to be right there, isn't there. I'm going to show you every bit of movie trivia knowledge that I have. And you better hope. That everything that you have is enough to beat me. Ah! <laughs> I was like, Molly, get it! 2 0, here I come. Ooh! Oh! The shade! <laughs> that was good. Love we it. We will be needing um, all the Jess's, shade. We need Jess's address to send her a fan. Uh, the shade. That was uh, oh, very shade. good. Are, it, wow. No one's surprised. I think the majority of the Love talking it. there is done by Love both of us. And rightfully so. They're good. proud of their All rookies. Right. They're proud of what they've done. But Schmodow but... introducing first. Introducing first. Representing the 10 with a record. Oh, one win. I love the dead no music. She is. Jessica it's pretty cool the with sleeper. the lion in the background. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Jessica Schlo, you are here and look at that. That is a that is a wall next to you. That is a wall next to you. That is <laughs> Look at the wall. So, <laughs> all right. You know, I guess people were saying that it was like so, open, or I like I, someone was there, like giving, I don't know. You, you know, people. Oh, uh, of course. Because you, you know, whenever yeah, women play the schmodown, there's someone off camera oh, whispering. Yeah, I think we have similar debut of matches. You know, maybe not the <laughs> best we could do, but um, so I'm not underestimating him. I certainly it's hope so he's dumb. not underestimating I can't believe someone said that. I have never heard that, but and working well, people sometimes aren't the brightest for this match. Hopefully, but. Yeah, he seems like a cool dude. I don't know. <laughs> he seems I would like say a that, cool dude. Except for that dude. whole New York Yankees affiliation. Now, yeah. Jess, let's <laughs> get talk a mark. About how get a mark. Oh, mark. Sense your match with Beth May because you got to Jill. You're like one step below. So I don't want to hear. Okay, you keep an eye okay, you doing well. need to do leave. Buy at it all, or do you Bye. try to stay just focused on the next? Billy in here with the puns. Molly, you can stay. Oh. I still feel like even though I won, people, I I appreciated all the support and the nice comments, but I don't think that there was this big, you know, um, thing that came out of it. So I'm still I'm obsessed with her lady preparing it as if it were my first or my. I like I love the Ivy How's lights. Working with Kate, it seems like this. Season, they sell those at um Ikea. At Ikea. No Kate for a while, she seems like she's oh, the most invested cool. of course that she's do. ever been, what and she really sell? is working with the competitors. How's it been like working with Kate Mulligan? Kate's great. Yeah, she takes care of us and like checks in and is very involved. Like anyone who thinks she isn't, like she definitely is. Um, we would all say that, and so I'm really happy that oh. she's my manager because like Schloth cat. I get that sense of support and connectedness. Ooh. Awesome. All right. Well, good luck to you, Jess. We'll see I you want just her to enter the Star Wars just so and we can call her that. The Schloth right. Cat. <laughs> Schloth Cat. The usual suspects. I wish Frank's name was Manimal and not Animal. No. Frank the Manimal. Animal. 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 Someone needs to get him a little animal muppet. Mm. The Shimon definitely needs more puppets. 
Oh, God. Definitely needs more puppets. Of course, you are back, and I gotta say, it, Frankie, look, man, I, I, I don't know you that well, but I feel like we've known each other for a little bit now, and I know how the no. New York. He's actually got stuff in his background now. He doesn't look like he uh, broke into a promo, someone's open house. <laughs> I would guess that you were My playing Rick Raddus is going today to absolutely so obsess over about, Frank's background because uh, of all the Power Ranger stuff. Focused on him. There's a lot of Power Ranger stuff. I'm digging it. Hello, Power I guarantee Ranger. you. Listen, Raddus is my a friend's going to immediately. Right? He's a pretender. He like likes him to come as the out best. Here. He likes to play games. He likes to talk a lot of smack and you know try to get everyone. You know, oh, oh, he's so fun. He's so entertaining. That's all it is. It's a shtick. Guess what? When it comes to me, I'm the real deal, baby. All right? I'm not going to put on these fun little games to get people riled up. I'm the real thing. But don't don't, don't be confused, okay? I might hold a grudge just as well as the New York Yankees hold that grudge against the Houston Astros. But right now, if I Oh, you can hold that grudge. Right, so that's trouble. fine. So I am 100% focused on Jessica. <laughs> Molly's like, what? I, as an huh? Orioles fan, still hold a grudge it's against uh, Jeffrey Mayer. But that's a different story altogether. Let's ask you about working with your faction, and in particular... Your manager, Sam Levine. He knows no, J- no Jake. No, Jake. His power is currently out. So he's sitting in the dark. So what do you feel like you he's sitting in the dark from his tutelage thing. or from your Not faction mom. mate's support? Not to mention it's well, like. Well, I mean, we have a really, uh, you know, passionate, knowledgeable. That's only 86. Uh, days. I assume if it, if it and, uh, know, comes on, he'll reason, join uh, us. Has not yeah. uh, produced as much success uh, in, in, in the in the points you know, aspect of things. And maybe people can look at it and just say, oh, look at where they are in the rankings. But the fact of the matter is, is that in the Schmodown, success is measured differently. Frankie's background is there like is no other faction that is working just the right amount of stuff. Uh, Sam it's not like in. mine where I just threw as much as I could. That you can't get anywhere else that are just going <laughs> just to right sit stuff. in your head and blossom into the beautiful, beautiful flower that is going to help you win in this game. Last question before we get going here. Um, you mentioned obviously taking Jessica serious. What is it? What is the strategy like preparing for sleeper? Well, I think it's just that. I love that uh, nickname. Prepare it, you know, and not taking her lightly. I think, uh, you know, Jess put up one hell of a fight and did incredible against a a tough competitor in Beth May. And uh, thinking that she's just going to roll over and take a loss is unwise. So uh, Beth May's a merc, right? Any other competitor out there, uh, I, I treat playing... A Jess Schloth as if I was going up against, you know, a Dan Merle. So, um, you know, just going in with that mentality, I think, is going to help me today. Hello, everybody. That's a good mentality to stick with. Universe. Yeah. Hello, fresh. I'll give you that Hello, fresh discount, <laughs> Christian Harloff. You're going to get fresh. <laughs> MTS I promise you, I promise you I'll use it starting today. August 1st. All right, Mark, our competitors I have arrived. I will use that discount. Number one. There are rules and regulations to the Schmodown. Here they are for round number oh one. Oh my God, I just had a brilliant idea we'll for eight questions. Made different corners of the movie forget it. We'll get Schmodown. back to it later. <laughs> so we are playing uh, the first no round, white for, no whiteboard for whiteboard. All three, I was going to say all four of us. The three of us will answer a line. Second and third round is screaming. Once we ask you by name, hopefully combined, we will all get over 10. Woohoo! <laughs> Hopefully, we'll see. How about we do me and Molly versus Brian? Match. If no, you heard a you, question right, guys, I might come in last. You just need to buy yourself another 15 <laughs> seconds to get that correct answer. I got a new sticker. Use one of your JTE rules. Oh, what'd you get? Beat the question. You also each have it's one hard challenge. to tell because it's a decal. Oh God, it's, point, it's Bernie right, with the mask. Yeah, you may it's Bernie the with his mittens. Oh, oh, I love it. Our content, and then it will be your manager that <laughs> confirms and ratifies. I got that from Sleep of Giants. Thank you. Is taking place. Yes, oh, Peggy, Peggy, you Peggy that cheer Start brings me straight back to high school. If one more person brings up the freaking Little Mermaid, I swear to God. I came very close to missing a Toy Story Jesse, question ready? on there. Yeah, that scared me. I'm ready. <gasps> then let's Freaking get ready little to showdown. Round yeah. number one. Question number one. We're going to start in the realm of animated. Even films. has a sloth sticker. The Illumination Studio franchise features the voice talents of Kristen Wiig, Jason, Se- Jason Siegel, Russell Brand, and Steve Carell. Oh. This Illumination Studio <laughs> Right. I didn't really understand the question. On the first word. Happens. Uh, oh, we don't get the clock it's here. It's a today. franchise, right? Yes. Five, four, I mean, five, I have it, but three, two, one. Despicable me. Oh, I guessed Angry Birds. 
<laughs> and let's go to. I forgot Russell yes. Brand is Despicable the me. old scientist guy um, in those movies. There we go. Oh, is he? Running. Yeah. Question two is in the world of comic book movies. There's these little comic books, mm. and they make big movies out of them. And here's a question about that. Big, huge point. ones. Which comedic actor co-starred alongside Val Kilmer oh. as the Riddler in Batman? I have. So, fun fact, this guy is one of my biggest celebrity crushes. I'm not Batman even ashamed son. of it. Batman really Same. Is, you know, like. Sort of forever. That really goes away. It just takes a nap. And he's up there with, he's like. He's drills, too, coming back again. Five. Uh, two, um, three. Nice. Uh, oh, my God, Judd Nelson. Yes, Young yes, Judd Nelson. We'll Jim Carrey. time with. Yes. Molly, are you ready for yes. uh, Michael Frank. Keaton Batman to come back? <gasps> the yes. best. Yeah, do, you mean, do you mean the best Batman? Question three. Horror the slash best. thriller. The best Batman. What is the name of the demonically possessed doll in the Conjuring? Oh my gosh! Look at me go. Own films. You know, oh, what is her Turtles name? Too, Christian, I feel like you were right at that age where Vanilla Ice hit you hard, and I bet there's some yeah, okay. pictures we could all. Enjoy. I didn't think I about it. To, I need to no, rewatch this whole that. series. I mean, yes, but not for that. Five, I haven't seen the four, spinoffs. Three. I haven't and seen any or the new one. I haven't seen the. I've only ever seen the nine. Annabelle. Yes. And yes. Annabelle. I saw Annabelle. Annabelle was pretty and solid. We will get to There's been four. two Annabelle movies. Right. Yeah, there's Annabelle, Annabelle and Annabelle three, Comes and Home. Or, I think it's creation. Action, creation. Adventure. Annabelle Creation. Yes, I've heard that so that one's three the better. Plays the video game heroine Lara Croft in what? 2018. Ha, Jake is going to be so mad he missed this. Oh. I don't know if this has another name. No, it's the name you're thinking of. Is it? No, I kind of like it. Yeah. You know, I mean, again, I hate the Yankees hat, but you could wear it. Four. Don't worry. Three. You tell him, Matt. Two. Uh, Matt. Whoa. I don't know if there's is more. It, down, is it the Tomb Raider? Raider? Yeah. Oh, it's oh, just yeah. Tomb Raider? Yeah, you're fine. Yes. Do I still get a point? Yeah. I still okay. know the cheat code, Tomb Raider. <laughs> that is correct. And I didn't know if there was more to that title. I didn't either. I was like, is there? The characters of Alex Pruitt, Uncle Frank, and Marv appear in oh. what family franchise? I, what? The only oh. Oh, that I still know by heart. Um, I think I know. I'm taking a guess. I, I'm a, I am too. I love that I know this. I think I guess five. Easy to remember that one. Four. Stop bragging. Three. I think I don't two, know that first name. One, Vacation? Home Alone. This time we start with Frankie. Home Alone. Uh, yes. Marv is the the tall, skinny, so uh, there, wet bandit guy. Uh, and I've seen I knew, that movie like once. Yeah, and I knew Uncle Frank. I didn't know the first one. Movies, Christian, they're perfect. And now we get to. I'm just still shook that Macaulay Culkin and Brenda Song have a child yeah. together. Uh -huh. That uh -huh. I was shook. Drier and drier by the day. Your question for a point. What two thousand nine? Excuse me. What two thousand eight? Comedy 2008 features supporting performances from Jack Black, oh. Jay Baruchel, Dana McBride, and Matthew McConaughey. Very so many. Um, nine for some reason. But it um, is, is this it? Uh, I don't think this is it. Five, four, I three. Shoot, oh, I think this is wrong. One. This is and the end. Up, hands up, and this time we. That's what I was thinking of. Just... Mine's definitely wrong. Not your it's way too early. It's incorrect. And Frankie, first blood, Tropic Thunder. Yeah. Oh, oh. Wow. 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 wow! Was that really in 2008? Yeah. That's yeah. Sci-fi. Matthew Vaughn directed what 2007 fantasy film that stars Charlie Cox, Robert oh. De Niro, and Claire Danes? Robert De Niro was in a fantasy now, film. This was a question about. Christian's head can or the answer would be every movie um, ever made because Christian loves this guy. I do, but still Can you repeat the question? Yes, we can. Here it is. I have no clue. Matthew Vaughn directed yeah, what two thousand and seven fantasy film that stars Charlie Cox, Robert De Niro, and Oh Charlie no oh no, that was okay, no, that's not no, what I'm thinking here. of. I have no idea. It's not the one with Chloe Gr like Grace Barrett's because that's a no. um, I came up on him. I'd like to put words Are you thinking out. kick ass? No. And five. Four. I think that was a three, Scorsese three, film, the one I'm two, thinking of. One. Pens down. Hands up, please. And we're going to start this time with Frank. I always confuse these two. Is it the Golden Compass? It is not. And oh. I didn't know it. Oh. For Stardust. Mm. Stardust. Wow. Yeah. 
All right. So Didn't see yeah, us. No perfect rounds here. We as we get the only Stardust I know is Jin or so. Yeah, right. people love that Stardust. Never made it on my radar, but a lot of rom-coms do. And I bring that up because your category is rom-coms for your final round one question transition. for a point. Which actress <laughs> stars in the romantic comedies The Holiday, The Other Woman, and Sex Tape? Oh. It's one of two. Let's scratch the last couple ones here. Yeah. yeah right beat myself up for that Stardust one. I don't. I know this isn't it, but I'm just three. I'm blanking. Two, I totally blanked. Ben's down, he's I put Cameron Diaz. Yes. Cameron Diaz. Yes. Yes. Ah, nice. It was either going to be her so or Kate Winslet for the holiday. By one as I love the holiday. Two, Me too. Round, Mark, that is Darn it. Yeah, well, you intimated the wheel around of that I wheel. Also. It's for fate oh, and doom. Five, oh, no. Justice, because each competitor right. does get a spin at that there wheel. Once Time you to scream. Category. Four questions. No, Jake's not allowed to still have 19. Is that even here? Rachel, 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 are you back now? Welcome points, back, Rachel. But stealing you are. is available. Yay. If two. not, so why are you here? Answer, you can ask us. <laughs> For multiple Enjoy choice, we're swell, fellas. We'll give you four Oh, is she on vacation? Oh, vacation. She's been on vacation for the last two weeks. No, I know she wasn't here, but I didn't know what she was doing. Vacation's so a good thing. So it is a one-point lead for the animal, Christian. Vacation. Both competitors looking spry oh, early. But Alvarez gets the Billy, of selecting whether he'd like to spin to the digital wheel first or defer. I will There's throw this board across Listen, the Listen, I might be an animal, but I'm also a gentleman. So I'd like to defer to Miss Schlote. 60 seconds, Kate, starting now. <laughs> <laughs> you look loose. You having fun? Uh, I am. Listen, there's a couple misses in the first round. Look Mark's the, face. The match isn't over yet, is it? No, it's not. <laughs> this is this is where this is where we pull into the lead here in the second round. So let's have a great Choo -choo. spin. You look loose. You are hitting all sorts. I mean, you had a couple of pulls there. <laughs> Mark, you, Mark. Mark. Word <laughs> choice. Uh, Phrasing. Right, Phrasing. Let's do this thing. Let us. Do you want to spin? Let's spin. Just chat. Should we just chat for a bit? I mean, we can just run down the clock. <laughs> <laughs> take a sip of water. Yeah, take some water. Oh look, she has orange <laughs> nails too. Duck, duck, duck. Crash! I can't believe you broke the glass. Yay! Hydration's Team important. Orange. Just fun. Just hydration's just important. important. Remember to hydrate. You know? Go drink some water, you know, or you'll die. On the, on the desk. While you're drinking beer. That's pretty <laughs> real. Cider. So here's the wheel. And There's water, water in cider. <laughs> it's a liquid. And right. Ben is in, Mark. And, and just what a the gem. The spin Kate is in. Christian. Am I right? Ooh. Oh, yeah. 2010s. I was alive yeah, for the 2010s. I was alive for that. I question. love these There's categories minus like three I've of them. Marvel is interesting. But I have Rager. been alive for this one. Rager. Uh huh. So I was aware of movies. This is a pretty point, solid so wheel. Uh, take it. Disney I and Marvel are on there. Disney and yeah. Rom-coms. Someone what is spin the one Disney. Disney. Kevin what Hart. Is one SNL? Next one? So Jess, I couldn't see what the one next to Disney uh, Someone, a young adult uh, novel adaptations. Oh, is give that, that to me. Let's make sure we can see the hands. Yep. From the Someone's been Disney, right but they can't Here's ask any Little question. Mermaid questions. Who directed 2018's Death Wish? Not a clue. No idea. I haven't even heard of it. I think even Alex would know this because he likes that's Eli Roth. It's correct for two points. Oh. Oh. Question two. Nice. Who plays the character of Kyle Reese in Terminator Genesis? Christian Bale. I don't know. I know he's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Jai Courtney. Who? That's your boy, Christian. He is now actually strange enough. Um, here is the next question. Okay. In the 2000 in film, Young Adult, Charlize Theron plays a ghostwriter that has written several books in what genre? Murder mystery? I, I would guess Young Adult. Yeah. Let's go multiple choice. All right. Is it <coughs> A, Young Adult, B, Romance, Unless it's a C, trick question. Mystery, uh, D, stick thriller. With mystery. I'm going to go big. I'm going to stay with young adult. I'm going to say uh, thriller. I don't know. And five. I mean, go it's got to be. 
is incorrect. That'd be young We're adult. Here. We're going to give you the what a, and the multiple choice options oh, in the two thousand. Tricky SOB of a question. I know because off. like a ghost writer. I'm going big. I'm just going to. I'm going to go the obvious today. route. Young adult. B. Romance. C. Mystery. D, I know, I've killer. seen that movie more than once too. I feel dumb. I'd be crazy not to go with the young adult. A as an apple. That's mm. correct for one yeah. point. Mm. There we go. Uh, I'll take those two. <laughs> all right. And so that was question three. Here's question four. Spike Jones directed Joaquin Phoenix in what film? Her. Falling in love with an uh, AI yep. system. Yep. Uh, it's a great movie. That would be Very a good movie. Movie. Her. That is correct for two more points. So Alvarez gets a one point steal, but both finds herself up by four. It is 12 18. All right. Sam got 60 seconds starting now. Got no points there. Dude, <laughs> yeah, here's why here. I love you because I know that right now you're angry at yourself for having missed Stardust. Quite a bit. I've never even heard, heard of Star Wars. one with a lead. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Big a lead as it I know the be. Golden Compass. That, my friend, that is the lament of that the champion. Said. That's what you are. You are a champion. You are playing spectacularly well. That was a great steal. Okay? You're not going to give up any steals in your round two because we know this wheel inside and out. You are covered. You are playing great. Shake off the miss in round one. That Shake means nothing. Shake it off. I am not worried. I am not going to harp on it. I always yep. confuse Stardust and the Golden Compass. Hey, Ru. Hi, I'm Ru. Moving forward to that wheel, and here it is. Hello. Wheel is up, and here is Frankie Smith. <coughs> it's humid in Jersey today? A little bit. A little humid. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. That's a shame. Nope. No, keep, 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 keep it. 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 I know we don't hate it. Uh, I certainly don't hate it. Uh, I there's other things. Keep it or spin again and get Disney. Love. Uh, so, <laughs> Unless it's a Little know, Mermaid I, question, it's and I can a little risky, you know, screw I can Take a trip down to Atlantic City, or I can spin this wheel again. I think I'll go with the wheel. Let's do it. So you're spinning again? Yes, spin sir. Again. Oh, right, here we go. Okay. Here's the spin. Now, Let's go Disney. Let's go Marvel. Let's go. There's really, PJ there's really. Red Sox. PJ is solid. Oh, that's the like. Brilliant. So, all right. So, Jodie Foster will be the mm. movies. All right, Mark. So now, I'm Peggy. I'm, I could probably get like one or two Stephen, Stephen King, King questions. I'm, I'm not That's like right. going to be in the next like exhibition match. Had two or one point for multiple choice. If you're not feeling your, I know it better than ninety percent of the other choice, and we'll check down to Don Mattingly singles. Here we go. Four questions in the world of Jodie Foster. Mm, the first one. Jodie Foster plays card playing con artist Mrs. Annabelle Brands. Oh, Tombstone. In what 1994 Western? Sure. <laughs> I think. Multiple choice, please. All uh, right, your four options for a point. Is it A, Bad Girls, B, White Earth, C, Maverick, <laughs> or D, Wagons East? I'll say Maverick, since I'll Molly's say, Maverick. I'll boy, say White Earth. Bad Girls. Sure. That is incorrect. And so Dang for it. a one-point steal, Jess, I'm going to repeat the question and the options for a point. Jodie Foster plays card-playing con artist Mrs. Annabelle Bransford in what 1994 Western? Is it A, Bad Girls, B, Wyatt Earp, C, Maverick, or D, Wagons East? Be Maverick. Just like the fighter pilot. Ah, that's a big one okay. Yeah, for okay. Go back I didn't know that. Alvarez I have not seen that. <laughs> two points in the world of Jody Foster. This is your second of four questions, Please, Frankie. Sir. Foster plays a character Foster. called the nurse who runs a secret emergency room for criminals. Oh, in a 2018 I film. Uh, I believe that is Hotel Artemis. Yeah. Felt a little John oh, Wayne, didn't it? That is I've heard of that one. Two points. And now Alvarez on the board here in round two. We pivot to his penultimate question in the wild world of Jodie Foster. And that is, Jodie Foster plays a radio personality who begins a quest for vengeance against those who assaulted her and killed her fiancé, leaving a bloody trail across New York This City. looks like a in wonderful world. film. Please tell me the name so I can watch it. A radio personality. Uh, choice, please. All right, you're that sounds this sounds point. like a delightful film when I'm not being sarcastic. One. B DJ. I'm gonna say no more. I'm gonna say vengeance because no she's seeking vengeance. It's a A is an apple. 
Well, I didn't even and guess. That is correct <laughs> oh. for a big point. Well, Christian used to have I a handbag that said the brave one on it. I and did. now yep. we go to your final question in the world of Jody Foster. This will be the last question before we hit round three. Frankie, it is. These are tough. This Neil Blomkamp film starred Jodie Foster and Matt Damon. I believe that is Elysium. I like sure. it. Apparently nobody I believe else you. Oh. Points. And now just like I was that, just waiting for a contact or Silence of the Lambs 13, question, and I got neither. 13 <laughs> None. Tied ball game going in to round number three. It is round tied number three. It is the final game. round. It is all tied up. I have eight and so far. now we are going... To I have five. Get the rules around. I still just Mark, have five. <laughs> I got eight. Oh, I'm in no the as well. In round number three, this is the round that will determine the match. Lest we go to sudden death overtime, you will each hear three questions. These questions are to you and only you. There's no penalty for missing a question. There is no stealing in round number three. But we do need some help from you. You're just going to give us a series of numbers. We need three numbers from the way he said that was like, we need some help from you, the audience. <laughs> you may not pick the same numbers as well, pick numbers well, for the competitors to pick. Responds to a unique category. Three and six. Movie trivia, showdown, mystery. JTE rules and challenges still apply. And so we go to Frankie Alvarez first. By Five, way of six, the seven. Frankie, you do Eight. not I hate, nine, nine, ten. Ten. I hate have the honor do that. of giving us your three. What if I do? Those are going to be my numbers in my next match. What if I do nine? Ten. What if I mix it up a little bit? Eight. Four. Seventeen. Eight, None four, of my numbers. For Frank. Good numbers. For, yes. I'll do twelve, sixteen, eighteen. Aha! 12, she picked 16, one of mine. Eighteen. All right. <laughs> so we have Yay. eight, four, and seventeen for Frankie. 12, 16, 18 for Jess. All right. And Jess has two. JTE's left, and Frankie has all three. Sam, we got 60 seconds starting now. All right, buddy, I have to remind you of something very important, very crucially important. Hit me. You have never trailed in this match. Okay? You have never been behind. Frank's like, I don't care. What? I'm not <laughs> behind yet. If you're here around two. Yes, well, he hadn't gone yet. That's the way math works. Uh, so you've never trailed math. in this match, and I am proud of you, and you're not going to trail. Okay? You're going to answer the questions asked of you, and you're going to win. It's going to be that simple. We may be tied again at some point, but I am confident, my friend, that after all three round three questions, you will be the victor. 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 The victor. You're crushed her. And the police are after you. <laughs> Hi, Kate. Hi, Kate. Hi, Jess. Um, will you remind me after this match, I got to cancel my palm reading with Sam Levine because he's terrible at predicting the future. Oof, remember well, when he told me who decided to pop in the chat? Hi, Frankie. Like on the very first and awkward. <laughs> oh, man, that's got a really smart. Woo! Woo. Oh, well, that's got to sting. Listen, it's any. You, you were behind, and you just pulled up right next to him. So, guess what? This is when, yet again, Sam's future prediction doesn't come true. You are loose. You're playing smart. I love watching time. Mark's facial reactions oh, to yeah. what people Deal. say. It's the it. best. Let's do it. Also, he's he's picked great numbers, and it seemed like Frankie was trying to remember what number. I just need like a montage of Mark Ellis <laughs> facial right, expressions. So our competitors are I feel like here. other than Jeff Kaiser, I would want and Mark, she chose category uh, 12, and that Kate is in to give me like a pep musicals. talk during a match. Her pep talks are solid. And that is correct for two points. And for a two-point lead, your question, Jess. James Corden, mm -hmm. Judy Dench, and Jason Derulo. Cats! Here in what 2019 musical oh, wait. based no. off of a From legendary night. Broadway show? Cats. <laughs> Is Cats. It not? Dang it. Of a recent what was that prom video that they were in? Correct for two points. The, for James Corden was in that one. Lead, yeah. And it's up to Alvarez to match. I thought. And I think that came out after. I think that came out after he Cats. chose category eight. Cats feels like so long ago. I know. It was right before the pandemic. Our movies for two points. For the animal, Frankie Alvarez, your question to tie. What is the name of the titular killer St. Bernard? In the 1983 Cujo. movie, God damn it! Novel by <laughs> that would be Cujo. 
<laughs> Only dog in cinema history. Hey, brain. That is Never even heard of that movie. Points. I we read Stephen King really? and so St. Bernard. It <laughs> can only be right, one so thing. Pros category 16, mm. and that would put us into fantasy sci-fi for her three-point question. Her three-point question. All right. As Christian said, fantasy sci-fi is the category and the question for a three-point lead. What 2008 romantic fantasy film based on a story by F. Scott Fitzgerald Features supporting performances from Taraji P. Henson. Only one I would uh, know is The Great Gatsby. But... I know, great, yeah. but they weren't in Great Gatsby. Yeah. Tell He's like my favorite me. author, too. Think Tell of more Swinton. books. Uh, Second one. The only All thing right, I know Tilda Swinton is in is Doctor Strange and Constantine. I know. What 2008 <laughs> <laughs> yeah. film? I was like, what is she in Scott other Gerald, than Doctor Strange? performances from Taraji P. Henson, Jared Harris, and Tilda Swinton. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, Chad, I am not going anywhere i love the dungeon yeah, i'm just saying <gasps> oh christian the sleeper has a three-point lead nice Dang. I did not know. Uh, well, Tell us never, never seen that never seen that movie chose category four we'll try to tie the never game give me a tilted sweat and slice i only know the two <laughs> is the oh she was in chronicles of narnia too That's oh she right. was she was the queen right. she was and the, another, the all snow, right. snow queen frankie to tie the lead of Schloth, your three-point question in the world of Matthew McConaughey, what is the all name right, all of right, the all Matthew right. McConaughey film about a video store clerk Clarks? who agrees to have his life no, filmed wait, he's not a clerk show. for a television no? show? No, I don't know. Video store clerk. No, that's Jim Carrey is Truman Show. Oh, yeah, show. that's right. Is that oh. Ed TV? Uh, it what? Is. Yeah, that is. means we are tied once again. Chris, that was like early 90s, wasn't it? And never heard of that never heard in of that. my life. So I've they heard of it. I haven't seen it. And now in order to take a lead and force Alvarez to hit his five, Schloth needs to hit her five-pointer, which is category 18. And that would be in the realm of romance. Realm of romance. Cute. Romantic Some of that movies. In my life. It is. <laughs> The question <laughs> violently for single. five uh, hashtag violently and single. A five point lead. Kyle Chandler plays Kate Blanchett's estranged husband in this film by director Todd Haynes. Nope. Uh I loved Kyle Chandler and I love Kate Blanchett. Blanchett. Is it, right. Um five. No. Nope. Repeat the question. Last one. All right. Me. Question in the category of romance. Kyle Chandler plays Kate Blanchett's estranged husband in this film by director. Oh, no, romance. I'm, no. The only movie I can think of is Carol that she might have an estranged husband in. What movie? Carol? Oh, it's it's so good. One of the best lesbian it's sex scenes I've now. ever seen. Oh, I signed me up. <laughs> Incorrect. We were looking for Carol. Look at you! Oh, oh shit! Right, so now Alvarez has I, an opportunity to win the game. The sex scene was so good, I completely point, forgot about he her husband. However, way, apparently, if he misses, five points to you. we are going to Yay. show death. All right, here we go. So he chose. Uh, sign me up for a lesbian sex scene. Seventeen. I'm in. I'm waiting for. Biopics. Amethyst. I used to say biopics. It's Amethyst. It's Kate, People make Kate fun of me. Wins, I now say uh, Wins, and now that is the subject Ronan. of your five points. Were there lesbians? Wait, is here. that Blue, or the blue Valentine? No, not Blue no. Valentine. It hasn't came out yet. 2-0 no record in the movie trivia oh. mowdown. The question. John oh. S. Baird directed John C. Riley in oh. one of 2010. It's that scene bio. one, isn't it? He's a singer. A what? Walk hard? Walk hard? That's not a like a real biopic, though. <laughs> Uh, five, oh, four. It's not walk three. Line. Repeat, please. First it's, one. You're thinking of walk hard. Remaining. The is that what I'm thinking of? of? Yeah. John S. Baird directed John C. Riley but in that's what, not a real biopic. Five. So I... no. <laughs> Isn't that like a mockumentary? <laughs> yeah. Of course it is. <laughs> Right. 
Excuse four, me. Oh, three, man. Two. Repeat, please. Second one. All right. The category is biopics. The question is John S. Baird directed John C. Riley in what 2010's biopic? What year did Chicago come out? I know it's before not. Before 2010. That was like 2002. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was pretty early. <clears throat> Five. Four. The Sisters Brothers. Is incorrect. Oh, We're looking for oh. Stan and Ollie and Christian. Get your white we words, ladies and gentlemen. Sudden death. Stan Pretty and cool. Ollie. All right, so we are gonna find ourselves. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! In sudden death with Schloth and Alvarez and Mark. What are the rules? Uh, OT what action. action. Well, you each get spotted. For us, it is the same as round one. Thanks, Rachel. I only rules. have no. I have seven. Like a round Don't let Jill take those two points <laughs> for that <laughs> one. Either Christian <laughs> myself is going to ask a question. <laughs> for cats. For cats. I definitely so said it before you. But I'm writing <laughs> lies. and writing utensil handy because you will be writing down the answers. You have 15 <laughs> seconds to do so once we ask the question. Once we ask you by name or nickname, please show what you wrote to your camera. At the same time, we you both got cats. I refuse to <laughs> anything less. Death, we both got cats. I'll give it to him. I'll be nice. I definitely said it. We'll move on to another ah, competitor. Miss the question. We'll move on to another query. If one competitor gets it correct and the other does not, checks uh, Chuck, so many FOTs this season. I love it. All right, because we are all tied up. I know. This is a great match. Unless it's Molly. Start with Sam. Yes. Frank, OT. Yes, Do you sorry, want to play uh, in overtimes? I blanked out for a second. Any JTs? One JT. Am I playing? Wait. 60 seconds. Sorry, no. Would you like, like to play said, in brother, overtime you Star Wars match? In this game, oh, and you're not no, going to start you. now. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, thank <Okay>? you. <laughs> Shake it off. Yep. Shake it all off. Brand new ball game right now. Right yep. now. It's only Although that would mean I would have done using pretty well. So maybe. You, <laughs> using the JTE if you need it. And writing down your best attempt at an answer. I've known all the OT questions so far. No blank boards. You got this, my friend. All right, let's do it. Right. Six seconds, go. Kate, starting now. Um, Jess, I know I already asked you to uh, remind me about canceling the palm reading, but will you also remind me to send um, Sam this uh, this little rag so he can polish his crystal ball? Because he is it's just not working, his future thing. Mark Remember says. he said that, that he was going to win round three? That, yeah. That didn't happen. Yeah. It didn't pan out. That didn't pan out. <laughs> You are. I, I love so her so you. much. You Me too. Such great pulls today. I I love your energy. I love how relaxed you are. You take it's freaking time. hurricaning outside. And and I'm I'm out there. <laughs> the worst thing that's gonna happen today is, you know, Frankie's gonna lose a match and your house is gonna blow away. It's fine. Uh, hurricaning. Oh, and you know your house will blow down. Oh, Whatever. Know, Everything's okay. I can't wait to scream in your face when <laughs> you do. That's Come way on. worse than a regular caning. Right where you are, sis. You yep. are it's exactly a hurricaning. All right. So the only the cane I want to have is that Cane's yeah, restaurant Frankie, Jill talks about. <gasps> Raisin Cane. I'm ready. I'm, ready. I'm, I'm ready. a fan of candy go. canes. Here's question number one. Ooh, that's true. Never mind. Take it. Adam back. Driver, David Oyelowo, Joseph Gordon Levitt, and Tim Ooh. Blake Nelson. I have, have roles no idea. In which Spielberg I've, film? I'm taking a guess. Spielberg. Oh my god, my pen. Oh. My pen. Five. I have to use Four. my repeat on the first Three. one. <laughs> Should repeat. Okay. Yep. Adam Driver, David Oyelowo, Joseph Gordon Levitt, and Tim Blake Nelson have roles in which Spielberg film? I have no idea. I guess because I have no clue. I when I hear the name Adam Driver, my brain just short circuits. I, I love Adam. <laughs> Five. St Steven Spielberg. Four, Spielberg directed three, a Star Wars. Two, Star Wars. <laughs> One pens down. I just said the Adventures of Tintin. And we start with Frankie. Like I have no clue. Of spies. I, and Jess. War Horse. Lincoln. Lincoln. Oh, okay. Well, uh, so both and Mark, now we get to Adam Driver the wasn't that question here. The second apparently, question. That's right. A baby guess Adam Driver. Both competitors, Christian. They're just you know, wasn't right, but but good <laughs> guesses from both. And so now we move on to your next question, and it is, who played Alma Beers Del Mar, Heath Ledger's wife, in the film Broken oh. Mountain? Ooh, 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 ooh! I think I know this. <sighs> 
writing down. Yeah, I have no clue. Competition I'm drawing like a blank. I don't oh, know how to spell her name. Oops. Wait. I think Four, it's this. Three. It's the chick from two, one. Hands uh, down, wait. hands up. I don't think this is right. I said from Terry Mulligan. Yes, and that's Frank. who I was thinking of. Michelle, Michelle Williams. Williams. Oh, Damn it. Oh. You get I get Carrie Mulligan question. and Michelle Williams confused. Here is our next question. <laughs> All right. The great Kali made his big screen debut in what 2005 Adam Sandler sports film? Sports. He's a wrestler, in case anyone needed to know that fun fact. Neither competitor seems phased. I know this is an... And five. Four. This is the only three, sports game that I know three, he was in and one, pen, that pen, early. I, I know this isn't 2000. The longest, the longest yeah. yard. The longest Crap. yard. Yes. Happy Gilmore. Oh. And oh. Nine. 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 What a match, <laughs> man. Yeah. Yeah. That was that tough. Was great Frankie match. Alvarez and what a match. This yard. They take the victory in sudden death. Two big fights. That's a no sports movie I've actually Frankie seen. Alvarez as he <laughs> I've goes seen a movie. Lomas and now with the sleeper and finds himself the winner. Good. 2019. Suspects did I win? Up two big points here. Or did Molly beat me with that five she pulled? <laughs> Congratulations. I and no, we'll that because I didn't get anything in round two. That I only got 11. All right, oh, I got so 13. Both competitors, sudden death. Uh, three questions, I believe. It's because it. Jake's not what a good here. match. It was, uh, that was it really was good. That was a good match. Started in the first round. I felt like so it was really evenly paced. And like, into the night oh, yeah. And kept on nothing, was, finally, nothing felt too easy or uh, too hard. Although, I don't know. The longest yard. Wins the match, and that the was the Jodie Foster uh, really questions were match. pretty hard to me. Yeah, yeah. Think about that, one of Adam Sandler's that was like one category I did not want to see. Adam Gilmore could have been, the and there was no like dirty gameplay. So, a tough yeah, question there. Not the a lot of trash talk. Now, just except the shade. Want to win? win. Just, just the shade from Jess. Look, when I was their age, I probably knew more about movies than I do now. But I don't think I could have pulled. There was like one other category on that wheel that I was like. The yeah. writer who is that? Them, and then, and I'd say other than that, I was like, I'll take it all. But Jody Frankie yeah. Alvarez, the animal, getting the W. All right. no well, now we are going to so. hear from Frankie Alvarez and Sam Levine as they are with Jillian Marie, who's going to be talking. What? To Here we are. Congratulations. Who? You are I know her. You sneaky with a snake. Record. How does it feel? <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> you know. Sam, did you did you take the time to pause? Hello that? there. Did you know I did? I don't know what I and the chat the goes wild. Oh, a nice spit shine. Inception. A nice spit shine and that came means. out beautiful, didn't it? Yeah. Me, oh, I feel great, Jill. Thank you for for being here. I and love the Beatles I feel poster great. in the back. Thanks. I was at my uh, mom's I am, house. I am pumped. I probably woke up my sleeping infant daughter upstairs, but I don't care because I'm two and zero oh in I the movie. I was at tradition. my mother's house, and that's. Awesome. On my and phone. That much for a <laughs> That's uh, why I'm shaking the whole round, time. <laughs> Stardust, Golden Compass. What was going through your mind during that question? Listen, 2007, oh, there were a lot of other things <laughs> on uh, the animal's mind than Stardust <laughs> and good old Charlie Cox. And, this is uh, weird. Oh, stop know, touching so my phone. I always confuse those I could two do movies. this. Uh, if there was a wheel slice, look, she's there. Two movies, I'd be in big trouble. Um, <laughs> she had to leave here to go do this. Uh, you know, I, I was I, thinking I, about doing that for a second. I was thinking, hold on, I need to get something real quick. And I was like, maybe. <laughs> and then I just didn't pull it. Uh, I'm a perfectionist, you know, and I, I was a little frustrated. Thank you, Amaru. At the end of the day, I, I had to uh, take it forward because there was no leeway. A little bit. Mr. The King, it is a little bit weird talking over myself. And Sam, I do have a question for you. Um, How much are your rates for palm readings? Because it looks like that crystal ball is in tune. I came up with that one by myself. I just want to throw that out there. I'm not here. If you're not in, I don't want, don't waste my time. Standing ovation. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sorry. Those improv I'm classes have paid off, off, man. It was, it was 19 okay, years right. of theater. Cool. Oh. Okay, we are to a no, so that could potentially be your future. But uh, both Sam and Frankie, overtime, were we expecting that? Uh, what, what were the nerves going on going into overtime? You know, look, I don't want to say we were expecting it, but we're never not expecting it. 
Okay. Uh, as 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 Ugh, Frank said before, this is weird. we prepare for every match. As <laughs> this is weird. I don't know what to do with my hands. So, I don't know what to do with my hands. Do you realize if you were to rewatch this, you'd be watching yourself and watching you heard watching me? Yourself. A couple yeah. times, we never trailed in that match. It's weird. No matter what Kate wants to say, we never trailed. Oh, chat brings up a good point. Jill, did you uh, did you know those answers? I no, I honestly you didn't because during the match, I was taking notes of what people were saying. Thing, yeah. So I could like ask I mean, questions listen, later. So I, I really I wasn't even at all game. paying attention uh, to what was being <laughs> asked. Sleeper. I mean, uh, it, it seems I'll like no one. Was I don't remember. I don't remember who uh, landed on what. Go, like I, you know, as far yeah. as it had gone. But spoiler you know, alert! Yeah, I didn't see this match. And, uh, obviously, I knew before. I needed to. Uh, you know, Hello. after seeing how she did round one, round two, round three, or I is, knew I needed. Or is what we're doing right now pre taped I was doing everything I could. And is that the live thing? But it got a little. It got a little late. Whoa. Oh, mind blown. 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 In the end. And, and who'd have thought? Mind oh, blown. Frank, you watch all this wrestling. Is that going to do you any good? I'll stop. I'm from POV. Your heart out. <laughs> I'm not from the now, showdown. Let's talk about the elephant in the room. Rick the Rage Erratus. <laughs> Triple R. Mm. Someone's been calling you out a bit. You're now 2-0. Oh. A little bit. Do you have anything to say to the Rager? Listen, uh, this ain't the first time I've seen an internet weirdo try to come for me. Uh, I showed <laughs> oh, the world what hey. would happen when Brother Lomas came up against me. Same I mean, look at me now. <laughs> and uh, Rager, you better hope, you better hope and pray that you start living that lifestyle, bud, because I've been a Rager way before you were even a thought. Okay, so it, you better be prepared. You better be ready. And if you're going to talk that talk, you better walk that walk, boy, because I'm coming full force at you. And I'm humble. Ooh. He said, I wrote the Rager rule book. He's hungry for your Rager. Thanks so much, guys. Awesome match. Awesome match. Uh, can't wait to see you soon. Thank you. Back to you guys Thank at the you. desk. Thank oh, you. so oh, oh, you oh, to oh. Congratulations to both friends. It's an animal, Christian. Oh. Oh. It's an animal. It's a good move. Uh, Let's just stay with Molly. So Let's end it here. We don't that, need to watch it. Uh, what it's match just, it was. Jill, you did great, but I want to know what Molly has to say. That's the, this is the real question. Now, we want to know what Molly what has to say. They're both I don't need to hear. Julie's really looks like she wants nothing to do with Jessica anyone. Schloth putting out a <laughs> hell of a fight. She's, She's like, like so done. She's exactly like, I like being petted, but uh, I was really happy on the couch. Jessica, Kate, things didn't. I, I, I that crystal ball. I mean, <laughs> what, what can I say about that crystal ball? <laughs> he wasn't right. He said they are going to win in round three. Also, when he keeps talking about, like, we never trailed in this match. If you look at the round two score on its own, he only got five in round two and she got six. So, yeah, okay. You know, oh, math. Like, numbers. But also, like, math. earned less in round two. So look at the round two score. Sick that match burned. That's a sad trail. Now, Jess, after that match, it we was a neck and neck. You guys were fighting it back and forth. It was him and then you and then tied and then overtime. Yeah. What was going through your head when you realized, oh my gosh, I'm going into overtime? Well, yes, the when it we were going into round three and the math and it was tied and I was like, oh, I know, like this and the could math. happen. And I was like, and yeah. the math. Like, yeah. Yeah. So I was just honestly, stay, same. Like, like anytime people are like, did time, you, you know? realize this honest, score was, question, and I was like, I. Cannot handle numbers. What they were asking for, so yeah. Uh, I'm thinking of someone movie said trivia. Wrestler, I guess. Maybe Just tell me fine. the score after each round if I win or lose. That's all. all right. Yeah. The math we, we're yeah. Doing. You must be really <laughs> proud of how Jess played today. It didn't. Not a W today, but she played amazing. Able to go into overtime today. How are you feeling about the gameplay from the sleeper? I'm. I'm so impressed because God, all, I have such a freaking so theater voice. <laughs> And I just feel like she had such <laughs> deep holes. What? It's your, your, it's your prof professional it's interview like voice. I really admire. I guess. She stayed calm. And to be able to. It's the same voice Alex uses for his videos. Like in the Schmodown. That's fair. I could hear Alex's Prepare, voice in trailing, anything and know trailing, immediately that that, that was, was him. She put up a fight. And so I've said this so many times. The same. Uh, every. The way, Every Sometimes time. the the W for me. Yeah. I wonder I, if you could hear a difference when he's here. talking like to his parents because he speaks a lot softer. And, and then when like, he's speaking to a complete stranger, like, he talks a lot lower. 
how the future yeah it's like fire. it's bizarre and so my voice definitely fluctuates my old coworker used to call it my disney princess like, voice it's like my customer service voice solid yeah like when i naturally like, talk to people i have like a naturally way, pretty low on behalf of a lower spouse, tone but i have my my disney princess yeah, customer service voice. About that. Apparently. i don't know yeah i'm on the phone yeah um, but he's the one that's going to be losing in the future. That, that's what I'm you oh. I mean, in that house. Yeah. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> that's shade. Um, but I, I just, I'm excited I, about Jess. And I know how hard she works. And I know that she has the support of everybody on our faction. And that, that you know, all of them were so excited. Checking Jess out. has a way to my heart. Ladybird, you know, Sloths, so me, my, favorite animal, <laughs> this was a w my favorite movie. For truly looking into the crystal ball of Jess's future here. This is this is one road bump on a really beautiful uphill climb, and we are love it. You know, love I'm, it. I'm so thrilled that she's on the den. I am too. Okay, well, and you bring this amazing presence when you play too. It went into overtime, a whole, uh, extremely stressful situation, and you're you're the sleeper for a reason. You were calm. You were cool. You were collected. You were like that little sloth uh, stuffed animal you have in the back there. So it was perfect. It's always a joy to watch Smart. you play. And now you have got, have two matches under your belt. You have a win. You have an overtime in your belt now. What's mm -hmm. next for you in this league, and what do you want to do? I mean, I would definitely love to play again. Um, but for now, I'm definitely going to continue to support everyone else in our faction. Yay, and teamwork. Always be in there with the studying. And then I will learn in that process, too. Mm. And I'll be even better in my Great next answer. match. So yeah. I was very happy with that answer. <laughs> Perfect. Let's keep that mentality for the next one. Kate, Jessica, thank you so much. I'm excited to see you play again. Uh, Christian, Mark, back to you at the desk. Gotta love the attitude. Oh, yay! Yay! And, and how yay. are you? How yeah. you not practice? Round of applause. To I, had, I literally Sudden death was asked like two hours no. before so that I had to do that. To a lot of great so I was like, I'm not home. I don't I'm have my laptop. Well, I have none of my stuff. Again. And now I'm going to root on the fact. So I so set up in my old bedroom at my yeah, mom's house. I got a step stool out. I put my backpack on it and like had my phone on the backpack. It was like suspects needed as Frank a jerry rigged before, suspects are having a freaking are, setup that i had to right do now, it was they need to start to but it was very up. fun this is a great way to start doing it because frankie yeah, alvarez starts i mean you did great if if i was asked to do something like that short notice the they would be like then you start moving uh, up just a little bit more. Let's talk to Molly. And this is I'd be like, be something if him and the race hey, do wind up. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's another way <laughs> uh, to gain points for your faction. Sure, do you know a lot about movies? Uh, to call people out, or maybe in this case, how, respond how, to people how calling you, know you so out. Much or just about have a until there's no choice <laughs> but to have. I would be a hot mess. I'd be like, what was your favorite question? Animal showed us here today is Radis going to be ready? On the other side of it, tell me all your secrets. I will say, Christian, Christian helps with prom. I will say that, which, is, time, but which was I very helpful, lot of but I, I came up with some of them on my own. Them which, on the question deck, because <laughs> she fun. is one formidable opponent in her young career. She so is one formidable She is. Opponents. What a match that was. In the schmodown ahead of them. And speaking That's of she's future, a sleeper. If you take her lightly. Here. Congrats Thank you, Mark. Yeah. She's a great force in the community and happy to have her on the show today. Check out her show, Certain Point of View. They're on every Sunday. It's Jill's show. Yeah. No, it's not. For, I'm just on it. Uh, I'm just here. You want, to, you want to get you want to find out what's going on in the match? I guarantee you, they're going to be talking about this. They'll probably be reacting to it, considering that she is going to look at us. Yeah. So, <laughs> look at us go. Uh, is also on the show. Please go and check that out. All right. So, Molly, uh, Andy you said your name, Molly. Great match. Very excited. Molly Jane is also, also on the show. Really yeah, That's Molly. you. Hi. Congratulations once um, again to the suspect. I thought you were talking about the dog. You, buddy. Yay. Thanks All for the plug. Right. Molly the dog takes priority over. Molly the Schmidt player. <laughs> Molly the human. Yeah. yeah. We both had a Molly and Jill sighting in this episode. I what promise if I'm, if I'm ever asked to do that again, I will be prepared and I will have an actual setup ready. I, swear. I mean, I, th I thought your questions yeah, you and comments were great. Be like an hour before. Thank you. Literally. <laughs> yeah. Literally. No, Literally. you did a great job. Thank you. Uh, and hopefully yeah. I get to do it again. But that match was freaking. Oh, Spectacular. It and, was. And so good. Skyland Moose, you're right. Yeah, Christian didn't have to plug POV, but he did. So thank I know. you. Thank yes, you, Christian. Thank you. That was very nice. But uh, yeah, Frankie takes the win on that one via overtime, though. So 
Uh, it so was a very close match uh, throughout the whole entire time. I don't think there was ever a point that anyone was up more than one point. Um, so, yeah, that was fantastic match from the two. Um, what are we thinking? What a match, especially with two rookies, like two rookies mm -hmm. going into overtime like that in their second match ever. There's veterans who have never been in overtime, you know, mm -hmm. so two rookies. This is literally their second match ever. And both of them being super chill and calm and ready to take on overtime. And it, that was a freaking tooth nail fight throughout that entire match. It was neck and neck. There was a steal and then another steal. And then, ah, oh, it was so good. And I, it's congrats to Frankie for that W. And I'm very, very excited to see him and Rager play next. Um, but I'm excited loud. to see. I know it's going to be, yeah. Put your, get ready for, put your, put your earplugs in. It's going to be a loud one. Um, but, <laughs> uh, I'm excited to see what Jessica's going to do next. Uh, she, she's like, I, like I said, she's the sleeper for a reason. She's scary. She's one of those, you, you don't expect it. She's silent and, sh but she's, she's like a shark. She's like a shark. She's not a sloth. She's like a silent killer. And mm. I'm, I'm excited to see, uh, what, what she's going to bring to the table next. Molly. Um, these two are like so well evenly matched as players. I feel like that's mm -hmm. the reason why we got to overtime because it was just like a back, back and forth kind of thing. It was like watching a tennis match. Um, and like, I just loved the kinds of questions that we got. Like that home alone question is next level the Not questions just were great in this in this match sneaky yes. questions too like peggy just said the young oh, yeah adult the young question. adult one yeah just like good trivia sneaky trivia um and yeah i think i think these two players played great i think they both are in a good position where they you know haven't been run down completely yet so they're like they're still hungry to get those wins in. So we'll, of course, see them back very soon. And I feel like they're both good team players. So uh, great match. Great players. Loved it. Yeah, I agree. Uh, this this is one of those matches that, like, whoever loses, it still doesn't feel like they have lost because they played mm -hmm. so well. Yeah. Like, if I'm one in one and get put up next to Jessica. Like I'm thinking like, okay, this person's really two and two, two and oh, like, sh I mean, she came in very level headed, answered these questions, did a great job. And like Peggy said earlier, um, she was a question away from winning with yeah. that young adult question. Yep. Um, yeah. They both played the game strategically very well with their use of, uh, multiple choices and stuff like that. Um, yeah, I, it, I mean, Frank, Frankie has the record two and zero, but Jessica might as well be two and zero as well because the way they both played, it, it, it. I mean, it, it, it's funny looking back now and thinking like after they played, like overtime seems like it <laughs> was gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Like, I mean. They were just so evenly matched throughout the whole entire time. And you don't see that very often where it's literally like punch for punch. Like literally it, I just, I, it kind of blows my mind how evenly matched they were throughout that yeah. whole entire match. It wasn't like one goes up, then the other one goes up. Then the, it was just pretty much just level. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, for, I can't wait to see who, uh, Jessica plays next, and if Frankie does take on Rick the Rager, let's make sure we have uh, our quiet ears on because I feel like that will be a. <laughs> we loud just won't match. talk. We just won't be able to talk that match because this is going to be a back and forth smack uh, talk. Party. I cannot <laughs> wait. So, um, Same. but yeah, that is going to do it for us today. Um, tomorrow we will be back for, uh, someone we've been waiting quite a long time to see. And that is, uh, Ty Lieberman and Josh Horowitz. Yay! One of yeah. Jill's 
and Molly and I and all of our favorites. Um, Yay. We've got Ty, who is just hilarious, and Josh, who is a very strong competitor. Um, so check that out tomorrow, and hopefully by this time, Jake's power will be back on. Yes, Yay. hopefully. <laughs> yeah, so. And then he'll take control of uh, hosting, <laughs> so I don't have to. But um, <laughs> for a certain point of view, I'm Brian. This is Jill. This is Molly. Have a great evening, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.